What are you doing, Kay? I'm getting I'm getting our um, high tech. Getting all ready to film for these people. Camera ready for us. All right. All right. Hey, Keely. Hey, Kay. Where are we? We're in Round Rock, Texas. Round Rock, Texas is about 15 minutes north of downtown Texas. We'll show you in our little map. But what we're going to show you today is a house that you can get that's currently on the market for approximately, the house we're going to go through is about 500000 Yeah. To live in Round Rock, um, which is probably the most popular suburb since the beginning of time around Austin, because it's famous for its schools, it's famous for having Dell computers, it's just it's close in. Dell Diamond. And it's already built out, so you can't find a lot of new construction here, but there's plenty of existing homes that are coming up now uh, if you want to make Round Rock your home. And we just showed you, or we're going to show you Round Rock Donuts. If you've never had a Round Rock Donut, you're missing out because Keeley says they're absolutely phenomenal. I've never oh my God, they're made with sweet potato flour. <laughs> they're so good. So we're showing you Round Rock today. So like, like this video, if you would, please subscribe and leave us a comment. Let us know what you think of Round Rock. Here's where we're going today. We start you off in, in downtown Austin, just to give you perspective. Head right up I-35 to the very large and close-in suburb of Round Rock, Texas. We'll take you to downtown Round Rock, show you the little downtown area there, and then we'll head over to the Round Rock, which is how Round Rock got its name. From the Round Rock, we're going to take you up to a house for sale, show you what you can get in Round Rock for right around $500,000. This house is in Mayfield Ranch, listed for $495. Hi, Keely. Kay. Where are we? Round Rock, Texas. We're in front of this little, cute little candy store. We're going to walk down. Candy. We're going to walk down downtown Round Rock. Are you showing you or me? You. <laughs> There's some vintage candy like Laffy Taffy and Sugar Daddy. Nice. My mom broke her tooth on her sugar daddy. What? <laughs> My mom broke her tooth on her sugar daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Just FYI. When you're in Round Rock, downtown where we are, you have to try this pizza, Slap Box Pizzeria. Ooh, slap Box Pizza. It's slap you silly. so good. You oh. gotta try. What? They wrap around They're infamous. the block. They, you, what were they on? They've been on all those cooking shows, not cooking shows, but drive ins, drive -ins diners. diners, and whatever. The, they come, people come from all over the world to get Round Rock Donuts, okay? I know they do. Okay, where are we going? We're gonna go see the Round Rock. Yep. A lot of people moved to Round Rock, Texas and don't even know that it got its name because there is a Round Rock. So we figured we gotta show you the Round Rock. Yeah, let's go. I don't think I've ever seen the Round Rock it's, and I've been here since 95. Oh, it's uh, <clears throat> it's really something. <laughs> so stay tuned. <laughs> this is the Round Rock. This is what Round Rock, Texas is named after. after. That's it. That's, that's it. The and then that's it. That's all you got. That's all we got. I mean, I don't know what else to say. It's, it's just kind of a round rock. Okay, yeah. <laughs> where, where are we? Where are we? We are in Mayfield Ranch. In Round Rock, Texas. Here we go. This is on the western side of Round Rock. We're going to go show you a home that's currently on the market for $500,000. Right around there. So show you what you can get for your money here in the Round Rock School District, which is extremely popular and desirable. If um, you've got little children. If you've got little children or big children. Here we go. We're going to go in here, Keely. We're in Round Rock. I'm trying to get this door open with the magic key. All right. Okay, okay. we're going to go into this house in Round Rock, Texas show you what about $500,000 can buy you. This is a little uh, room, looks like a dining room slash, it could be your office area right away when you walk in. Keely, what's the square footage of this one? Uh, it's right at 1,900 square feet. Okay. 1,900 if you didn't hear that because we forgot our microphones. That's right, but, <laughs> but we're here, we're showing you this. this. Look at the wood floors, love those. Really nice real wood floors. Yes. Open plan, there's the kitchen here. Got some granite. This house shows a lot better in person. 
It really does. The nice appliances. Fresh paint. I smell the paint. I love those window coverings you right do? there. I'm just thinking I would yank those down so fast. Oh, I, I don't, I, I like them, Keely. Okay. Oh, but you know what I love always is a gas stove and, and oven. Yeah, I and have, that one's new too. Yep, it's a must have for me because I'm a big cook. Okay, so here we are still. This is the living room. Keely, how many bedrooms? Uh, three bedrooms. Three bedrooms. This is the primary. It's a one story. It was built in 2004. Okay. This is a big primary. And, and from reading the listing, this, this is brand new carpet. Okay. Smells like brand new carpet. Let's go in here. Let's Fresh go what's in here. Oh, that's, that's the paint. Maybe that's getting a little long for me. To oh, look at this. This is nice. They just redid this. What do you think? Look at these countertops. I love these. Yeah, two sinks, master. We sound like realtors. Primary bath a bit. Oh wait, we are realtors. Oh yes, we are. <laughs> There's a pooper. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, we're gonna go in here. Look at the size of these. This wing is where you put your little nitwits. All right, the, or your mother-in-law. Or just your stuff. Yeah. I mean, this is actually a great home for two, three, four, five, six people. Yeah, new carpet, new yeah. paint. Here's a guest bathroom. Very nice size. Check out this second bedroom, it's huge. Okay, we're walking towards the front again. And this is like Keely said, and I got this at the beginning of the video. This could be your office or your dining room if you still, if you're. Usually when you see a light fixture, that means they used it as a dining room, but I would never need a formal dining, so I'll say it's an office. Yeah. A it's lot big, though. Yeah, a lot of people work from home now. Oh, ooh, Keely. Okay. An office parlor. Yes. All right, Keely, let's go out this back door and show them the backyard. Just in case they have dogs or cats. Do cats go outside? Oh, no. In this neighborhood, cats could. This is a really nice park. Wow. Look at the oh, trees. Look at that workout stuff. Kay, you love it. Oh, you my God. Work out here. Oh, you want to get a workout in before yeah. we go? Oh, yeah. What do you do? Is that, is that, is that workout? Or? I don't know what, what, what's Jeez. happening. <laughs> and then this is what you do when you're, when you buy the house, you go out here and then you, um, you, you swing from these things, I guess, or I don't know what you do. <laughs> grass, it's, what kind of grass is here in Austin that's what you see? Okay, so right here we've got St. Augustine, and it's really hard to get that anymore because it does use a lot of water. But it is drought resistant. No, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, I lied again. It's just that if, if, you, <laughs> if you get a brand new house, this is important. You're going to get that Bermuda grass stuff and, you know, because it doesn't use as much water, the Bermuda grass that they're putting in all of the new construction homes. But doesn't it dry up? It dries up and looks shitty. So what's the, but, what do we use? Oh, there's Zoisha as well. Zoisha is yeah, yeah, very that's, nice. That's a nice hybrid, I think. Okay. We're but, talking like we know what we're talking about <laughs> grass, but I will tell you, this is St. Augustine's hard to find. Love it. Dogs love to wallow in it. All right, Keely. That's, that's our grass 101. <laughs> <laughs> we're out. Okay, what do you think about the price of that house right now? For five hundred thousand dollars in Round Rock, last year that house probably would have went for six hundred fifty in one day, and it's been on the market for what sixty days now. So it shows you that now's the time to buy. That's there are some really some deals out there now that are falling through the cracks because people are really nervous about the economy. But don't be nervous. Now's the time to buy. It's a huge indication that the market is shifting towards the buyer right now. So. But you know what? I mean, this is the Austin metropolitan area, and it could swing back so fast your head will spin. So, I mean, I'm not want to be all salesy and all, but if I were a buyer right now, I would be excited. Yeah. So, if you're wanting to buy in Austin, now's the time. Reach out. Give us a call. Well, What's that's up? all right, Kay, because a lot of people like to live in the suburbs, and some people don't. And we're, that's why we're showing everything. And that's why we're wearing ourselves completely out. That's the Round Rock, Round Rock, Texas. That's what it's named after. That's as good as it gets. Go ahead and like this, uh, this video if you would, please. Subscribe, give us a comment. Let us know what you think of Round Rock. Again, we're realtors here in the Austin surrounding area and we would love to help you out. Whether you live here, don't live here, 
or leave us a comment and let us know what you want to see. And if you come in town, we'll also text us and we'll take you around Austin because I've been here since 95 and she's been here since the beginning of time. Since, since they founded the Round Rock. Okay, I'm showing you this giant gummy snake for a reason. You have to go to our video called Living in Austin SoCo. Something about red snakes. Oh, it's the red snake. 